the streets of the Bronx taught Mary the rhythms and stylings of hip hop, and with her miraculous voice, fueled her rocket to stardom. But along with the Grammys and glamour, Mary J. Blige still saw some dark places. The self-love still wasn't there. It was just a suffering, a, a constant suffering. And what the music business did, it just made it worse. It made everything worse. It gave you money to cover up everything. <laughs> And then I got to the point where I felt like, you know what, I'm gonna surely die. I'm gonna die. I'm literally, I'm gonna die if I don't do something different, if I don't change my life. And how do I do that? What do I do? You're Mary J. Blige in the music business now. What, what are you gonna do? My whole movement since the first album I made was about saving women. What Mary did was channel the pain, confusion, and darkness and on May 9th, 2008, announced the formation of Fawn, both her gift to women and her saving grace. Fawn is Foundation for the Advancement of Women Now. We are an organization that works toward empowerment of women. And um, we opened a center in Yonkers for women. It's called the Mary J. Blige Center for Women. And it's the most amazing thing that's happened to me in my life. It's saying, wow, I did what I said I was gonna do when I said I wanted to help women and I, and I vowed to never see a woman hurt again. It's a place where women can go um, nurture themselves. It's a place where they can go uh, find and seek refuge. It's a place that truly is about making you better. I guess emotionally, it is that beacon of light, that hope for people who didn't have it. Mary's foundation wanted not only to give women hope, but to empower them to change their lives. It is our idea that uh, empowerment comes through education. And so we work very hard to educate young women in several ways. So it's not just about getting them to college. Sometimes it's just about getting them through high school or getting them back to high school. Through scholarships, grants, and programs that foster strong self-esteem, career development, and personal growth, Fawn helps women gain the confidence and skills they need to achieve success. Fawn was an idea that came from my friend and partner, Steve Stout. He was one of the people that helped me when things got really ugly in the music business, and he saw me and saw who I was and always had my best interests at heart. And one day, he came to me, and he said, Mary, what are you passionate about? I said, helping women, saving the lives of women. And when she talked about helping women at that very moment, that's when I knew, you know, the special person that I was dealing with. And then he came back with this idea of fawn. With Mary's passion and Steve's dedication, Fawn became a huge success. Her partnership with Mary J. Blige includes proceeds going to Fawn to support scholarship grants and programs. Fawn's already making a difference and it'll create a dyna new dynamic, not only for young women, but for the change that will have a lasting impact on our world. And I'm incredibly honored to be here and have the opportunity to support these efforts. Out of all my accomplishments, I'm most proud of Fawn. It is definitely my dream come true. It's definitely the reason why I think I was sent to this earth. My music career is a great accomplishment, but without my music career, there would be no Fawn, which is what I've been striving to do all my life. I said the four key words are love, laugh, live, and give. And giving, uh, like her, her foundation farm, you know, she's helping the other women. She's identifying with, with where she came from and giving back, man, that's as good as it gets. And thanks to Mary, Fawn gives back in a way that stands apart from other charities. I think the biggest thing that sets us apart is, is the presence of Mary and the idea that somebody of her celebrity status wakes up at 5 a.m. in order to show up at a school at 8 a.m. any day of the week that we ask her to do it. She's there. She's there. She is more involved than any celebrity I've ever seen in a charitable effort. So with Fawn, 
she goes out there. She actually goes to, to the tutoring. She goes to the colleges. She goes to the women's centers. So she's not just writing a check. She's not just raising money. She's not just lending her voice. She's in there. She's, she's speaking to the girls. She's touching them. She's holding their hand. She's listening to them. This is the pride of my life, this center, because it comes back home to where I've seen women unable to cope in life because they didn't have access to all these things. So for her, Fawn is very personal. Um, it's very much about her giving back and her trying to help someone else not have to go through what she went through. That's a wonderful feeling to have, to know I am a part of those women graduating and getting them, putting them through school and that's, that's amazing to me because that's something I didn't get a chance to do, which was graduate. So when I look at those girls, I see nothing but inspiration. They remind me why I'm here. They remind me what it was all about. It's very important that they see somebody that they can identify with and know that they came through the same thing, that, that, that went through the same trials and tribulations that she did, and there is light at the end of the tunnel. And that's what Fawn is all about, is serving women. You know, caring for women, inspiring women, and she is an inspiration to all women. She is spirit, she is soul, she's Mary J. Blige.